Hey guys, and welcome back to Freedom Fighters. When we last left off, uh, we were looking for a way over, and apparently here is a way over. Just over the bridge. We must have missed it, I guess. Still, let's go. We don't have a full complement of men, though. But, eh, I'm sure we'll be fine, honestly. Just get some fire in there. There we are. Make sure it goes right in through the hole. Cook as much red meat as we possibly can. Eh, eh, eh. Right, come on, lads. Let's go. Oh, God, they've got machine guns. Oh, they've got machine guns. Of course they've got machine guns. They've kind of always got machine guns. Get some fire up there. Oh, hello, buddy. Not that you're my buddy. I don't like you, actually. That's why I'm killing you. Let's try and get behind this nest. Come on, boys. Right, that's the nest empty. Cool. Alright, let's go patch our friend, though, up. Because we need everybody battle ready. Although, first, let's try and fucking gut this place. Shoot my friend, will ya? How about you fuck off back to your own country, son? Well, I'll just kill you instead. To be fair, killing you is more fun than you sending up. you back. You know. So Alright, cool. Back to full strength. Ready to roll. Um, now. Ooh. Got a sewer over here somewhere. Might as well pop that sucker open. Might be able to get another man as well. Cloud, you keep nudging the microphone. Why don't you just sit down and settle? You're not really helping the war efforts. Are you a commie, Cloud? I think my cat's a communist. Are you a commie, Cloud? <laughs> now she's like scratching her ear right under the mic. Come on, Cloud. Seriously. You better not be red. Um, now, how many medkits have we got? We only got four. That's kind of cool, though. That means we can grab all of these. How do we get that one? Aha! Ooh, hello. I suppose we'll heal these guys. Fall back. Yes, sir. Falling in. Aboard. I'm behind I mean, you. that was quite expensive for the med kits, but... Yes. Yeah, you are going to come with me, buddy, because I just saved your ass. You know what that means? It means your ass belongs to me. If I saves it, I owns it. That's how it works. But we now have all these men. <laughs> Although, he really doesn't look great, does he? Two of them. We have two uh, commie soldiers with us, and they're really banged up. I, was, I still think it's weird that if you rescue an injured commie, it'll work for you. Get out of here. Oh, there's a rocket launcher there. Do we need a rocket launcher? I don't know. Half tempted to take it with me. Oh, hello. We might, because there's another one here as well. Right, fight through them, men. Charge! Destroy everything. Burn the place to the ground. Surely we should be taking this place over, not, like, burning it to the ground, but... Hey, I don't make the rules. Oh, shit. How have I ended up with that? That's better. Definitely did not want to end up with that stupid SMG. The SMG that I love, but you get no ammo for it. And there's a guy up there on the tower. <sighs> tower! Alright, well, let's sneak... Oh, <laughs> I'm shooting my friendly commie in the back. Probably shouldn't do that. Oh, hey, guys. Where are you sneaking to? I guess you're sneaking to your grave now. Fair play. Come on, boys. This way. Oh, hello. Bloody hell. There's a lot of you in here. Jesus. Well, clean house. All right, man. This way. Let's roll. We're rolling, all right. I don't know where we're rolling. Rolling out here, I suppose. Oh. Okay. Well, that was that. And another place falls. To the Freedom Phantom. I guess now we have a cinema under our belt. 
I mean, that's got to be good for uh, morale, surely. Thought we weren't recording then. I was like, yeah, damn it. That's another chapter done. Cloud, look. You're a commie. Okay. Commie, <laughs> commie cat. Ooh. Tomorrow is Cosmonauts Day. Celebrate curfews lifted until 10 p.m. We have breaking news in the war against the rebels. Earlier tonight, a rebel stronghold was successfully Wait, captured by our troops. The head of the group is one of the most prominent leaders and symbols of the underground resistance. Oh, none wow. other than the brother of the alleged Freedom Phantom. The Phantom has been unmasked. His real name is Christopher Stone, a 32-year-old hey, plumber. After a brief interrogation by our intelligence officers, the brother, Troy Stone, confessed to his participation in many crimes carried out by the rebel group. Now repentant, Troy Stone has agreed to send a plea to his brother to stop further terrorist activities. We take you live to a press conference at City Hall. Shit. Citizens of New York. A dark chapter in your history is drawing to a close. Here now is the brother of the Freedom Phantom, with a special plea to his brother to desist from further fighting. My, uh, my brother and I, we were just bored, and we sort of drifted into crime at a young age due to a, a lack of direction. Or, or ideals and Always the video playing games. video games all night, violent ones. Eh. The society we grew up in kind of abandoned us, you know. But it's never too late to straighten out. So, um, so Chris, for my sake and the sake of the new system, I, I, I beg you to stop your terrorist activities. We okay, just surrender to the authorities, and and they'll treat you fairly. The Soviet government gives you their word of honor. Just. Please do as they ask. It is obvious that the heroic Soviet army has Everything once again. Everything I said was lies. They forced me, Chris. <laughs> Don't believe this stinking propaganda. Keep fighting. Set us all free. Ah, ah, no By Stalin's beard. <clears throat> and now to the weather for tomorrow. I hear it is uh, getting colder, comrade Ileana. <laughs> <By> Stalin's beard. <laughs> I can't believe they slipped that in. That's pretty good. That's going to be the name of the episode. By Starling's Beard. <laughs> That's fucking brilliant. <laughs> um, okay. Hey, look at all the camps we've got now. All the tents. Bye. Beard. <laughs> By Starling's Beard. That's fucking brilliant. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be laughing about that for ages. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay, oxygen. <laughs> it's not that funny. Well, it is, but come on, man. Oh, fuck. Well, wow. looks like we're like the becoming the last bastion Excellent of hope. Work. Handling of the command center was very effective at quelling further advances mm. by the Soviets. Well done indeed. Yeah, well, it's not all good news. Oh, we got Jones. a new... Tell him. Tell him what happened. We're seriously yeah. hurting here. I'm sorry to have to tell you, Chris. Whoa. But your brother is dead. Shortly after he appeared on television, he was taken to Governor's Island. I understand that he was executed personally by General Tatarin. It is said he died like a man, without a flinch or tear. I know it is painful, Shit. but you can be proud of him. Man, I can't take this. You know, Tatarin's gonna pay for killing Troy. He's gonna regret he ever stepped foot in New York. And I say we hit him with everything we've got. Probably and not a good plan. Chris, I'm sorry. I know it hurts, but we need to keep a cool head. We don't want to do anything irrational. Yet... I have a strange feeling about us. Yes, well... You must understand that the only action now that will truly hurt the Soviet agenda is to mm. assassinate Tatarin. Eliminating him will spread chaos in the Soviet ranks and give way to a united American resistance. Oh. Oh. Well, that's a brilliant plan, Jones. Really what do we do? Invite ourselves over for a cocktail, then slip some cyanide in his vodka? So we're gonna need some serious 
firepower to take him down. That guy's got his eye on every rat and mm, cockroach on the island. Point. Jones might be right. If we did manage to remove Tataran, it could be the turning yes. point for our cause. Let's double check our intelligence. There has to be a way to get him. After yesterday's hit on their installations, they'll be expecting company. This will need oh, to be shit. a surgical strike. We can't risk sending in a squad. I'm afraid this oh, is a solo goody. operation. Or a two-man operation. Yo, I know this is personal, Chris, and that's cool, kid, but if you need me, I'm with you all the way, buddy. Bring on Tatarin and his boys. I got plenty of bullets for him. I quite agree with Isabella. This mission calls for stealth, not <laughs> ham-handed bravado. There's a sniper rifle in the weapons gallery. Chris, I'll arrange for a rowboat for the <sighs> island. Damn. Um, okay, so I guess we're going solo. I don't really... Ah, binoculars. Some, yeah, we now have permanently have binoculars. Uh, that's... Interesting, I guess. Can we actually swap weapons here? Uh, I think we have to take the rifle. So, our brother got iced. Um, I don't know... Well, we didn't see him die, but okay, game. There's a lot of people in here now. And this place is looking pretty cool. Now, the only thing is, we need this to be decked out with the skulls of our enemies. Maybe Tataran's skull. Could be, oh, no, 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 no. We don't have Tataran's skull. Pride of place. Just above there. Um, okay. Oh. You must assassinate Tataran. Without his leadership, the Soviet armed forces will crumble. This is no easy task and demands stealth if you are to succeed. Bide your time and find a good sniping position. It is the key yeah, to your success. Uh, okay. I don't really remember this mission much, but what's the worst that could happen, honestly? We are going to be... Oh, hello. Nice boat. We are going to be fucked, though, without our guys. And they send us in. They send us in with 15 bullets. And the revolver. Well, okay. Uh, okay, well, I don't know how stealth we have to be, mind. I guess we don't have to be too stealth. Stealth is not the way we do things around here. Why be stealth when you can shoot everyone in the face? Can we go up here, I wonder? Oh, we're actually injured now. Look. Got like bandages and shit on. That's actually quite cool. Alright. Now, what's the betting? We're not going to be able to get a good angle at Tataran. Oh, this is open for us. Okay, that's feeling a little bit convenient, but cool. I guess we'll roll with it. There's no reds down here, is there? Ah, looks like we're fine. We're all on our own, buddy. Let's go murder someone. It's been like 30 seconds since we've murdered someone from the Red Army. That's not acceptable. Oh, hello. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. sneak. Ooh, oh, really? Really? You couldn't hit him from there? You couldn't hit him from there? Oh, boy. Right, well. This is gonna... Ooh, hello. There's a lot of reds here. Oh, that's great. Hitting the bloody blades of the van. No matter. We shall persevere. And we've pretty much chewed through all of our ammo already, which is not great, but we have thinned out a lot of these guys. There's no bullet drop or anything. Although I'm not surprised, it's an old ass game. Um okay. Hey pal. Ooh, right in the melon. Dude, that was brutal. You're a stone cold killer, my friend. Okay, sometimes these enemies die in one hit. Sometimes. Do we honestly need the rifle? Oh, fuck. Don't want to do that. 
Now where's Tataran? Where's Tartar Sauce? Um, okay. Well, we thinned the herd out, so... I mean, that's something. I don't have many... Oh, hello. I thought you might be coming up to meet me, sir. Let me stick this down hello, your throat. Hi. Swallow that load, mate. Alright. Um, uh, ooh. This is fancy. Can I have some more, like, rifle bullets, please? Please? No, I suppose not. If they're going to send us on, like, a borderline suicide mission, you would at least thought they would have given us a lot of ammo to play with. Uh, at least give us a competent handgun. Oh, man, there's always rifles. Oh, hello. Gee, sucks to be you guys, I guess. Ooh, medkits. Well... We're kind of in spitting distance. But do we actually need that, though? I don't think so. Like, why would we? Let's go grab an AR. Yeah, we need some proper firepower here. The rifle's, like, okay, but... It's as much use as a fucking chocolate dildo when you're actually in the thick of it like we are. Not too bad when you're far away, but you know, CQC requires something a little bit more shall we say, automatic. Okay. Well, there doesn't appear to be too many guys around, and there is plenty of medkits. Which is nice. Cloud, you're being a commie again. What is it with you being a communist, Cloud? Seriously. Commie cat. Oh, hello. Hey, guys. Sorry, but, you know, this is America after all. I think that's how you say hello in America. You shoot the pass. You just shoot the passerby. At least this is what the media um, has me believing. And we all know. You don't trust the media. Hey, guys. But then we should also think that the, Amer uh, the Russians are evil bastards. Which, again, I'm pretty sure is not accurate. Right. Let's get this over. Oh. Oh, we can't actually go back. We can only quick save. That's interesting. But, again, makes sense given the context of the mission. All right. We shall have our vengeance. Oh, who's shouting at me? You shout at me all you like. I'll whistle back with this rifle. You little shit. Hello. You're going to regret that, pal. If the noise <laughs> drop like a sack of shit. He's just like, he's just had enough, mate. He's done. Oh, hey, guys. Sorry. I appreciate you probably just pissing in the corner, but... I'll have none of that here. Oh, hey, pal. Ooh. Where's your leader? I want to have words with him. Big words. Kick him in the nuts a couple of times. You know. I think he actually sat on the grenade. He was quite happy about it too. Maybe some kind of fetish. I don't know. Buddy, you shouldn't have got off that turret. Let's be fair. Oh god, hello. Grenade fetish. Well, you're dead. Hey, where did you come from? You know what? I don't like your face. Because I don't like you, that means you can burn. <laughs> He's like, ouch! Ouch! This hurts! My skin is melting off my bones. Yes. Excellent. Alright. Well, excellent progress is being made. Although, we haven't exactly been quiet, have we? I think Tatarin might know that we're here. He may do. Big bear. Big... Oh, fuck. That was right in the skull. Jesus. Good thing we're wearing a hood. That could have been really fucking painful if we had nothing on our head. Ah, oh, hey, guy. 
he, he was quite happy about that, you know, just getting shot in the dick. It's like, this is fine. Hello. Now, not bad considering you're a trained sniper. And John may never have used a rifle before in his life. Ooh. Not bad at all. Give me the fucking rifle. Let's go. We got some vengeance to be had. Okay. Hmm. Alright, pal. Oh, wow. There's a couple of them, isn't there? Uh, let's give them some grenades. There you go. Have a fun pineapple to play with. Don't get too close now, kids. He'll have your eye out. There we go. That's what we're talking about. It's definitely an art to the throwables in this game. And I have to be honest, I'm not really sure I've got it down. Slightly getting better. Slightly. Okay, I can't seem to quite get it over that last step, but that's fine. Hey, buddy! What have you got going on in here? Anything good? You've got some nice supplies here. What have you got? It doesn't matter. It's all going to be mine soon. Well, ours, I should say. Whoops. Not that I'm an evil guy in the slightest. <laughs> Huddle together, boys. Keep warm. It'd be horrible if you burnt to death now, wouldn't it? Okay. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, what the hell? You know, I don't want to know what you guys are doing behind there. Okay, you can keep whatever the hell you were doing there to yourselves. Wow, how many- is this a clown car? It's like a clown car. Russian equivalent of a clown car. Damn. Wow, these guys are coming through the woodwork here. Literally coming- Um, excuse me! That is absolutely ridiculous. Okay, I think we just like annihilated the entire Russian army. They were hiding behind these boxes. Ooh. Ah, he's got something meaty. Well, let's give him some fire. There you go, buddy. Just thinking of you. Got to keep you warm. That's all I'm trying to do. And we're going to be chewing through medicates. What the frickin' hell is he using? Is that Tatara? In, if that is, we're going to burn him. I don't care how many Molotovs it takes. Hey, look, you can go away. Buddy, look. I got no beef with you. But now you're cooking like a nice piece of beef. And, ooh, I almost cooked myself too. Yeah, this guy is tough. Whoa. It's like got a heavy machine gun. Maybe even a light machine gun. There you go. Have as much fire as you can. And if that doesn't sort your problem out... Oh, I think he's dead. Good. Good. Finally shut his hole. What have you got? Oh, we can pick the machine gun up. Nice. Nice. Just what the doctor ordered. Why be running around with a tiny little thing when you can run around with a... Uh, PK, whatever the fuck this is. So I think that's what it is. Um, okay. So this douchebag is in here somewhere. Let's eat a med kit. Let's go have a little explore around here. There might be more ammo or something. Or maybe some more med kits. Well, I've enjoyed the barbecue. That's for sure. It has been fun. Can we? Oh, we can get up here. Maybe. Ah, ladder. I guess we can. Alright. Maybe we can snipe him from here, but I don't think so. I think we're going to have to get nice... Oh, hello. I think we're going to have to get close, personally. Punch him in the dick. Nice, we'll have that. Okay, there's nothing actually in here, apart from a med kit. That's fine, though. Might as well check the other one out. Because we do like our medkits. Sorry, I keep calling them medkits. Our sandwich boxes. Turkey and ham, I assume. 
Actually, I don't know. What would Russians eat? Probably beef. I guess. Stroganov. Or something. Hmm. Borscht. <laughs> oh, God. I don't know what Russian delicacy is, actually. Oh, we can't actually go up to that one, but we can go up to that one. Maybe. Nah, I don't think we get a good overwatch on the guy, to be honest. Oh, well. Let's just go into his house. Knock, knock, motherfucker. Oh, I don't think we can. We have to go the long way around. But that's no fun. I wanted to kick the door in. Stick this up his ass. Pull the trigger until he sings the stars and stripes. Which could be quite hard to get him to sing that. When he's coughing up his own guts. You know what? Have a nade. Oh, fuck. Hot potato. Hot potato. There we go. Don't say I don't share. Alright. Although that's gone way the fuck over. Oof. Well, they're shooting at something. We're out of all the good stuff now. Um, right. So this is where we're supposed to be. But there's nobody here. Are we supposed to be? Yeah, maybe we have to go over there then. Might make sense. Unless that is Tatara up there. I doubt it. Oh! That was him. Okay. I was expecting a twist. <laughs> That's interesting. Well, he died. Like a bitch. Let's rattle off some rounds. Don't know if we can actually destroy this chopper. <laughs> one for one, I suppose. Well, the big bear kind of died like a little bitch. That was cute. Really? This helicopter is like it? I would have thought... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I mean, that's not uh, shit on the helicopter, of course. It's still quite an intimidating weapons platform. Come on. Come on. Come on, don't die, don't die. There we go. Whew. Oh, we can quick save it. I mean, that's cool, but what do we do? Oh, do we have to get back to the boat now? Shit, probably. All right, let's have some sandwiches. No. Abort. We're in too deep to abort get now, you fool. Can have some sandwiches. Uh, this leads to nowhere. I can't remember how we bloody well got in here now. Shit. Alright, well, this is looking a little bit more promising. Um, as much as it pains me, let's Regroup. grab Pull up out. an AR. So we're going to need something with some firepower. Are there no dudes here? Have we exterminated them all? Murdered the entire Red Army? Well, that's good, I guess. Let's hit up another quick save, just in case things get heavy. Oh, I hope they don't sink our ship, our mighty fine vessel of likes the world has never seen. I need coffee for this. Cloud, you're being a communist. You're stopping me from doing stuff. Oh, fuck my ass and call me Charlie. He's angry. Yes, ouch. <laughs> Oh, bollocks. Um, let's run. 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 Cloud, you're literally sitting on the control pad. Just lay down, okay? It's not difficult, alright? If I ever had the urge to sit on you, I wouldn't circle you for about an hour before I sat down. Mm, pain in the ass. Don't have cats, guys, honestly. 
They drive you mad. Run! Just keep running! So not only did we single-handedly, like, wipe out his, uh, his guards, we also, uh, killed him. And I wish we could destroy the helicopter as well. That would just be the cherry on top. But I guess there will be no cherry on top today. Well, we did fill it full of holes, so, you know, there's that. Although, I don't fancy our chances from getting away. I hope you can row quite quickly, buddy. Killed 56 enemies. Nice. Is this Chris Redfield? It may be Chris Redfield. Well, one for one. They killed our brother. We killed Tititin. The great tit is no more. And for the longest time, I thought those two, like, sticky outy bits there were spiders. But <laughs> they're not spiders. Oh. <laughs> Remember me, Chris? Yes, I know your name. Perhaps this is more familiar? What? Hello, Christopher. You see, I've resumed my original profession. You never questioned where all that juicy information was coming from. That's what I love about the Americans. One finger up the nose and the other on the remote mm -hmm. control. You were also busy entertaining yourselves to death. Well, our great nation was busy. Busy liberating Europe from the same fate. Our horizon grew, while yours has faded out. Shit. Um, I forgot about that. Um. Shit, they've completely taken this place over. Bollocks. Uh. Okay, well, that's problematic. And they've taken all of our weapons as well. Guys, you, you're dicks. Alright, well, let's go. I guess we're going to have to... Oh, God. Oh, we can swim? Okay, we can... Guys, we can swim. That's cool. Not sure why we ever need to swim, but... Well, apart from, you know, there. Right, you fucks. What have you done with all my friends? If you've killed them, then, well, I mean, I'm I'm going to kill you anyway, but... Well, I don't know what I was saying now. Ooh, found some nades. I mean, I'm going to kill you guys anyway. You have no options left, Chris. There is only one way is that right? Now. I will see to that. Uh-huh. Cool story, bro. This ain't the end of the game, surely. Uh, I'm not just saying that either, guys. I, I genuinely can't remember. I haven't played this game for a long time. But we are on 32 minutes, so I'm going to have to end it there. Ooh. When we come back, are we close to the end of the game? I don't know. Huh. Hmm. If so, it's been a very short game. Mm. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, till next time.